guys, I'm going down to uh, the sanctuary. Got some little tomato plants and some bigger tomato plants and some little pepper plants. And we're going to put them out. This is uh, Friday afternoon, good Friday. It's the time to put stuff out. So let's go do it. Oh, no, 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 you're not going, are you? Woody, do we got to take her? Oh, Lord, Woody, wag your tail. Let's go. I don't want to take her, Woody. I just don't want to take this baby. You're a goat, honey. You're, you're really a goat. You're not, you're not like my boy Woody. I don't know. See, it didn't want to start because you're going. We're on our way down the sanctuary. And uh, put these tomatoes and pepper plants out. Uh, I gotta get better friends, I do. I gotta get better friends. Better people to hang out with. <laughs> The splitter has been working real good. They have their system here, and I have my system. But it looks like it's already open. Okay, it's fine. Do, 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 do. I put them in this cage to keep the cats from messing with them. Yeah, you know cats can do. Uh, I didn't want to get messed with anything. Okay. We got some jalapeno peppers. These smaller tomatoes are called uh, Homestead. And these bigger ones are Better Boys. And I think there's three varieties. Let me check them. <laughs> yeah, tomatoes. No, that's the name. Early Girls. Early Girls, Better Boys, and Homestead. And you see, I put another panel up on this end here. And I got panels on both ends of the door so little goats in case they come in to visit. Can't get in my garden. <laughs> and hopefully the chickens don't come in. I see that gate over has been left open, Ellie. <laughs> right. Let's we'll start. And these are gonna be the, the better boys. Okay. Pull this out, let's put it right in here. Somewhere where I can see what they are. And I wet these down so they pull out pretty easy. Just drop them down in these holes. First thing to do. So. I'm going to dig a little bit deeper, okay? I want more of that, more of that stalk, that stem, down in the dirt. So look here, I'm gonna put it down. Show you a little bit better. Look how much I've covered up in here. And I'm gonna put some potting soil down around that, okay? So, we'll dig each one down like that. Still sticking up that much, I want them down deeper. Yeah, like so. That gives this plant, if I bury it up to here, it's gonna sprout roots all up and down the, all up and down the stalk because everywhere it's under the, under the dirt, okay? So that's gonna give a better, a better root system to it. Okay, like so. I don't mind doing it with my hands. 
So, I got my little heifer over here with me. She came. She ain't no help. She don't plan on helping. Look at my other heifer. He don't plan on doing a dog. When are you going to help that all? When he said, Pop off. <laughs> I had a shot yesterday. I can't work. <laughs> oh, I'll tell Gigi that. When he, in the center over here, I'm going to show you. I've got it laid out for five, no, six little plants. I'm gonna use these smaller. I think, I guess I'll take my pepper plants. I may put them over this tree, Some my pepper plants over here. Uh, I don't think, hoping the goats don't get to come in here very often. I don't wanna mess with my pepper plants either. They're little right now. They can't hardly get up in there, but they could. I don't know, goats, goats can jump pretty good. I may take them home and put them in pot plants. I've thought about that before. It's, I've raised pepper plants before in pot plants. That's what Tina and Rob do. And it's so much easier it comes winter time. You can put them in out of the weather and they'll stay alive all winter. You know, so I might do that. Okay, so let's get busy over these other plants here. All right, I'm gonna come around now. I've got them all set, the depth I want them. And I'm gonna put couple of handfuls of uh, potting soil around each one. Then I'm gonna cover them up and water them in good, okay? Burst, burst of energy here. Water it in good. Give them a good drink. I'm not sure how fast this this uh, raised beds will dry out, so I'll come down at least every other day and water them in good. They may dry out pretty fast. I don't know. I'll right, show you what it looks like. Okay. At least that much of that uh, tomato plant is underground and it will sprout roots, grow roots all the way up. Okay, at least half that is underground. Okay, I'm gonna water in there. It's kind of help I get laying there and chewing our little coot. <laughs> yeah, that is my help right there. That's a nice shady place to sit, you know, during the summertime when I come down and work. Cushioned, you know what I mean? Bring me a big old glass of tea and sit in there with my feet propped up. Play with them little cats. Loving them her, Woody. The days of Lex is not here. Kippy, <laughs> your Lex is here, forget Kippy. All right, I'll finish up here. Uh, I, uh, 
show you what I do. I fill them in. Get it down, get it around the root. You ain't got to do this. I do it some. This is pretty dry over here. And, uh, you okay, Wood? And then I'll pull that dirt down around you, okay? It's good and wet down in here now. All right, guys, I got all the little cucumbers watered in. I've got the tomato plants all set. Uh, and covered in and watered. I put two in this little corner here, two pepper plants. A little bit of space there. And I put uh, the small tomato plants here in the center and watered them in good. And uh, these cucumbers are all doing good. Uh, I've got four pepper plants left over. I could have put a couple here, but I've got cucumbers going to grow over this here. And I've got my tomato plants here. So right now, I'm going to go out and sit with my little girl. And in a little bit, we're going to be gone back to the house. I'm going to take these four. I could put them over here, but I'm afraid the little goats will be in here in and out here. And they get a little bit bigger there right up there and pull them down and eat on them. And I can put them in pot plants at home. I think would be good. And these four I could probably save next year and uh, by putting them in a bucket through the winter. Okay, let me go put them up and I'm gonna sit down a little bit. You come up here? Come up here, Papa. Come on, come on, come on up here. Come on, I'll help you. I'll help you, Woody. Oh, yeah, I gotta help Woody. <laughs> okay, guys. I'm just gonna sit here and relax. Uh, I think it's all gonna be good. And today is Good Friday. I'll come back. Uh, we'll probably be fine until Monday. I'll come back down. I may come Sunday evening and, and rewater everything. Not every other day, I think. And Jamie told me if I need to, it gets to where it's a hassle. I can hook up uh, soaker hoses. I have a couple of soaker hoses. And I can lay them, you know, in here and just go around. Put a splitter and, and come across up yonder. And what's kind of what I'm gonna do with her? You come up this side and around here. And the inside, I just water it by hand. Wouldn't be no need putting a soaker hose a little small in the center. But that's, I don't really see it's gonna be necessary. I think we're gonna be good. I love this setup. I, I love this. You know, this is, it's so easy. Uh, it'd be quite a feat building one of these like you at my house, but it is awesome. And that concrete slab makes it so much better. I mean, you're, you ain't got to worry about weeds, nothing growing around your feet. You know, you just walk in on that concrete, just walk around that water and check this stuff out. Uh, I, I'm excited about what it's going to do. So far, it looks like it's going to do good. But I've only got my cucumbers been here for a few days. But I don't know about her, guys. Bootsy, Bootsy, Bootsy. Don't get in nothing over there. Woody, I don't know about Bootsy, baby. I don't know about Woody. We don't know about her, Papa. She's just a goat, Papa. You gotta realize she's just a goat. I know. She's not like us. Leave that alone. It's not for you. That's for cutworms. Had a few cutworms in my cucumbers. I'm gonna put just a little bit of seven dust, not on the cucumbers, but around, around in there. Had to either kill them out or chase them out, one or the other. So that'd be good. All right. No, Woody. We're not gonna mess with the little kitties. They're coming up here looking at us. I hear this noise. 
behind look down. And there's there was two of them coming up out of there. Woody, don't chase them, okay? Don't chase them. Are you a wild kitty? Hey, are you a wild kitty? I'm not gonna grab you. I'm not gonna grab you. Here, hey. <laughs> oh, Woody! Mama says no, sir. <laughs> Come on, Woody. Come up here and pop off. I told you. I told you, son. No. That cat don't want Woody around them kittens. Come up here. Come on. Come on. Come on, Woody, up here. Come on. Come on, Papa. Come on. Come on, Woody. Hurry up. Woody said, Lord, Papa. She's a killer cat. <laughs> she did not want you around that cat and babies, did she? No. It's okay, chickens. Woody didn't know. Now Woody knows. Woody knows now, don't you, buddy? That little cat's a what in the world? <laughs> Woody learned a lesson, folks. Woody learned a lesson. I told him, but I didn't see her. I thought, don't scare those babies off. But mama come around the corner, she saw Woody looking at him, and here she come. That's a good mama cat. That's a good mama cat. She's a good mama, Woody. You better stay right inside Papa. You better. <laughs> oh, but she said, my Lord. I thought it was a tiger. Booty save you, you better leave her alone. You better not even go over and look. I'm serious. You'll learn you'll learn a lesson. Booty no. said, I ain't scared of cats, Papa. <laughs> yeah, all right. Booty! Booty! We're leaving. Bye! Bye, Booty! Bye, little girl! Bye bye! We're leaving! She can be so hard hitting. Look at her. Look at her. Yeah. I'm leaving you. Come on. Come on. Hurry up. Taking her time. Taking her time. A little horn scalp come off one side. Little bloody spot there. <laughs> they don't hurt her. You rub on it, play with it, it don't matter. But the good thing is she's not going to have horns. And that way she won't be hurting other children when they're playing with her. Like kids do. She'll be able to buck their heads and not, not hurt one. Or stick a horn in their eye. I had to close that Ellie's gate back. Relaxation. I decided to come over and love my girl. Yeah. Dan never showed up to cut your hair today, did he? You know, uh, it's a little bit not right. You want you got an appointment with a doc, with a uh, hair stylist, and they don't show up. What? Ah, these people. I don't want to scratch your butt. You know, scratch your back. She can't wait to get his hair cut off. I can't either. You know, you can pull, you can pull some of it out. You can pull it out. And you can brush it out, but it takes forever. Man, you can just cut it right off. But listen, I, I don't want to deal with y'all today. Thank y'all. I really don't want to deal with y'all today. I've been working in the garden. I'm tired. You know, Papa gets tired. <laughs> You're on my foot. Yeah, you know, I stopped here to relax. This is this is relaxing, I guess. I guess this is relaxing. Loving on my babies. Yeah, loving on my babies, pulling fur out of them. Just pulling old fur out of them. Look at that fur. Yeah. All on your neck. Dad's got to come cut this hair off. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe I can talk him into it tomorrow. What do you think? Well, I don't know, Papa. Let's talk about it. <laughs> I 
brought y'all some hay. Go eat it. Leave me alone. Just let me sit here for a little while. Just, just let me sit here for a little while. Me and Woody's been working in the garden, and we're tired. We're a little bit tired. I don't need all this. I really don't need this. Beautiful day. <laughs> Beautiful day. All right, we'll get a suntan now. I got a suntan in my head. No, your feet hurt. Your feet hurt. <laughs> I'm sorry, but they do. Your feet hurt. You do it to my head. That actually feels pretty good. Maybe that night when I'm watching TV, you can come in and rub my head. <laughs> Maybe rub Gigi's head. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Oh, yes, let me see here. Sun's my ass. It's a windy day. The wind's out of the south though, and it's really, it's really nice. Uh, we're fixed to drive down to Camp Heidi. Uh, I'm gonna go down and spray that that was briars so they don't come back right there at the camp. Some old saw briars, huh? they ain't good for nothing. They grow up, grow up in them trees. You try to, they got them, them thorns all up and down them. Oh, what they good for? Do you? Nothing can eat them. I don't know why she had these. These guys are eating their hay. They're eating their hay. Not this one. Hay's for. <laughs> hay's for sissies, Papa. <laughs> All right. You know. What you got? Go. Take off. I don't, I don't like all that. After a while, I got a hair all over my, all over my hands. <sighs> okay, enough of this. I'm through with this. I, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Yeah, I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm not gonna be a beauty come out of here. <laughs> hey, yeah, she's not coming out of with my papa. Not get my papa lap. Nobody can hurt. Nobody can hurt me in my papa lap. No, they're not gonna hurt you anyway. Oh, them two back over there might act a little crazy. They'll act a little crazy. Yeah. Gigi will chase you if you run. She won't hurt you when you stop. I like her coming out here. And if she come through the fence on her own, that's the only problem. I'd put her out here right now. If uh, she could stay in here, but she just comes and goes. I want her to get used to these goats. Because this is where she's going to live. And... That'd be a lot of fun together. But uh, to do that, Ben and I is going to have to roll out that other row of the wire attacher to this fence so she can't get out. And we may do that Monday. We may put her out here Monday and she'll get along good with them. I mean, I'll watch her, you know, and I may put her in a crate at night inside their stall. I bring a crate around, put it in the stall so she'd be in there be protected. At night, during the day, she can run out here with these guys. And then when I get ready, to, get ready to go somewhere, I can drive with her to the gate. She can load up and we'll go. Then when I come back, I can, nah, I don't want to look at it. I don't want to see it. <laughs> uh, I come back, I just drop her off in here. So she'll have the, I don't say the best of both worlds, but she'll have a good safe place here and still be able to go out and hang out with us during the day. But uh, she can't continue to hop, run on the porch and run in the house every time the door's open. Because springtime, summertime, that door's open a lot. Except for on the hot, hot days, and that should be closed. And I don't need her in and out of the house on the furniture. Yeah, that's true. I don't need it. Okay, don't need it. Do this. 
Settle down, little girl. Settle down. <laughs> you see, it's, it's a scab right here. And it come off this side here today. Her playing around, you see it. If she'll be still, you can see it. But anyway, the other one, other one will pop off too, and then it'll eventually scab over, then hair over. And you'll never note it. Don't bother you, no, it doesn't kiss. Yeah, don't bother me, Papa. <laughs> hey guys, I'm gonna cut this off and get that to you. It'll probably be for Monday, the 1st of April. Be <laughs> April Fools. <laughs> April Fool's Day. If I get something else, I may can move it up some, but I may not, you know. I've been putting a few out at night. Uh, we, Lester and I talked about that a little bit. He said, Dad, you, you notice putting, last few days, you're putting out morning and night. He said, you think the nights do better? I said, well, they may. As far as uh, YouTube goes, it shows more folks tuning in at night than they do in the mornings, but I've been doing them in the mornings ever, you know, ever since I started. And maybe, maybe, I don't know, an evening one when I have time to do an evening one is kind of like a bonus, you know, I don't know. Uh, I haven't really thought about that much. Uh, just sometimes I have quite a bit, just a little stuff I do during the day, when you start trying to put it together, it's too much for one video. Uh, so I, you know, just leave it until I have something to go with it. <laughs> and I'll add something to it and make an evening video. Uh, have I thought about moving my things to the evenings? I don't know. I mean, most, a lot of folks been with me ever since I started and they like the mornings. I think a lot of folks work during the day and don't have time to watch the videos until night. That's why there's a lot more activity at night, maybe, sometimes, not always. Uh, numbers may be down a little bit, you know, maybe. So, <laughs> maybe they get tired of it, you know, they get bored with me, I don't know. Uh, but my video is just what I do during the day, and I, you know, when it, that burns out, it burns out, you know. Uh, I, I enjoy doing it. I enjoy making a video of what I'm doing. Don't do a lot. Don't do a lot because I got people like this that won't let me do a lot. No, they won't let me. <laughs> Poor Woody still licking his wounds about cat that at LE. I bet he don't mess with a cat no more. Anyway, folks, uh, I'm just sitting here rambling on. Uh, I'm going to cut this off and get out to you. Hope you enjoy it. I'll, you'll either get it on Monday or maybe. Saturday evening, Sunday evening, who knows? I don't know. Catch you guys later. Don't forget, subscribe if you haven't. Hit the like button if you like it. Share with a friend. What do you think, Woody? Share with a friend, maybe? Woody says, yeah, share with your friends. <laughs> I love you guys.